you can't underestimate the power of making something visible. And that's what this competition does. It gives us a platform to see the humanity of the problems. We know the challenges that startups face, and we engineered this competition to give these entrepreneurs an opportunity that they might otherwise not have had. The beauty of DIC is that it is mixing and marrying technology with the traditional means to ensure good governance in developing countries. Meeting the mentors, talking to the jury, and also meeting like-minded people who are willing to risk and vet their ideas out there. That is something very assuring. It's almost a childlike energy that enters the room and it's at that moment that you begin to see the change in the ideas, in the pitches, because people just lose their borders that they came with. I look at it as an incubating process where these eggs <laughs> were just forming that idea and some of them even just taking it apart and putting it back. QIC is a very vibrant space where it allows us to bring technology and prove it can actually solve some social problems. Being a tech for good company, it's not all about the technology. You might have the best technology in the world, but if you don't engage people, it's worthless. So we got a lot of work ahead and we need to just face the challenge. It's really about what the finalists are going to do next. If they continue to take the skills that they learned here, they're going to do more and more good. Ooh,